Debbie, it's always great to hear you speak. I know it's always a treat. I'm going to learn something, and I did. I, I know nothing about matzah, nothing. I don't, I don't even go down the aisle. I don't know, you know. And so I really like, first of all, that you brought, see, again, she's supposed to have two, at least two visual aids. And I love that she had a variety, not just the crackers, but she had the word here as well. And that was, that was great, doing that. The, um, also, the, having the sample here with the recipe I thought was very clever and very nice to do, something extra. <laughs> so again, the visual aids were great, the speech was, was very uh, well done. I just feel that also, um, you didn't come out from behind the lectern, and I was surprised because this is your speech eight. So, you know, you should be out here and just engaging and, you know, feeding people crackers or I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because you're so great. That was good. You're so great. And also, you relied a little bit more on, on your notes than what I thought you should have at this point. So, let's, you know, work on that. Uh, but I did like the story of the Hebrews. And, and how they bake the bread on the on their backs in the sun. That's interesting. And it was also the um, it was good that you referred to the registered newspaper article. So it shows that you did some some homework on it. And you had let's see. So I guess it was well researched. The words that you chose were appropriate and effective. And again, your body language, you know, you use your hands a lot. But again, I would just say to come out from behind the lectern. It was a, a very, very good speech. And I don't have anything else to say. So thank you so much. Thank you.